Parshas Teldes, Rishain, Chapter 26, Perekhof, Chapter 25, Parav Tofei, Pasik Yutes. Pasik says, Ve'edel Teldes Yitzchok men Avram, and these are the children, these are the generation of Yitzchok, the son of Avram. Avraham, Ha'ilid Yitzchok, Avraham gave birth to Yitzchok. Rasha says, Ve'edel Teldes Yitzchok, Yaakov Ve'esef Hamorim Ve'parsha. What does it mean, tell this? This refers to Yaakov and Esau mentioned in this section. Avram, this is Yitzchak. Avram gave birth to Yitzchak. So the question is, it already says that Yitzchak is the son of Avram. Obviously, Avram gave birth to Yitzchak. Why does the Torah have to say it again? So Rashi says, Ayyidesh, Kosov, HaKosov, Yitzchak, Ben Avram, Huskat, Lema, Avram, Hayli, this is Yitzchak. After the Torah says that Yitzchok is the son of Avram, the Torah has to say that Avram gave birth to Yitzchok. Why? Because the jokers of the generation were saying that Sarah had conceived from Avimelech. Why? For she lived with Avram for many years and they did not have any children. So what did Hashem do? So cluster He shaped the facial features of Yitzchok's face to resemble like Avram. And now everyone attested that Avram had Yitzchok. And this is the meaning of what the Torah says: Yitzchok, the son of Avram, Avram because here is the proof that Avram gave birth to Yitzchak, the fact that Yitzchak looked and resembled Avram. And Balaturim says, Hoylid is a doyme, to tell us that they looked very, very similar. Yitzchak was 40 years old. The Kahti is Rivka, and he took Rivka as a wife. Who was Rivka? Bas Psula Arami, this is Psul, the Aramean. The Padan Aram from Padan Aram, a face Lobana Arami Lili Isha, sister of Loban the Aramean, to himself of a wife. Asha says, Men Arabim Shana, 40 years old. So Rashi explained, Shalaki Shabbat, Avram, Mahar Miria, and his pastor Shanil de Rifko. When Avram came back from Har Miria, he was told that Rifko was born. The Yitzchok Hayab and Lam Zayin Shana, Yitzchok was 37 years old by the Akeda. Shalaki Baby Perek Mesa, so at that time, Sarah passed away. Now, Yitzchok was 37 years old. For she was, and, and I she explained, She was nine years old when Yitzchok was born. And she was 127 when she died. She never, like the Torah says, we learned in the last expansion, why you fight a story with gamer. So Yitzchok was 37 years old. And at that time, Rivka was born. So Yitzchok waited for her three years until she was befitting for marital relations, and then he married her. The daughter of Psuel. From Padan Aram, the son, the sister of Lavan, Rashi says, Don't we already know? Didn't the Torah write that she was the daughter of Psuel and the sister of Lavan from Padan Aram? Rather, the Torah tells the priest, She is a Bas Rosha, Vachis Rosha. She was the daughter of a wicked man, and she was the sister of a wicked man. And she had also the place where she came from was inhabited by wicked people. And yet she did not learn from their deeds. Why is it called Padan Aram? Because there were two Arams. Aram Naharayim, Aram Tseba. This is Aram Naharayim and Aram Tseba. Kero is a Padan. It's called Padan, which means peer. But it's referring to the two Padan Arams. Oshin Tsembet Bukar, an expression of a peer of oxen. Tagum Padan Tayran, as the Tagum says, Padan Tayran, which is peers. Others interpret Padan Aram Aram. Others interpret Padan Aram as the field of Aram. Because in Arabic, a field is called Fadan. 
Pasik Chov Aleph. My Ta Yitzchok La Hashem and Yitzchok Davin Ta Hashem Lenech Ishte opposite his wife Ki Akara E because she was barren. My Yosher Loi and Hashem accepted his davening at the Har Rivka Ishte and Rivka became pregnant. She conceived. My Yeta Rashi says, What does that mean? Here brought the Hifzer Ritfila. He davened and he entreated Hashem with davening. By Yeter Loi and Hashem accepted his davening. Nispatzer when nispayis when nispata loy. Hashem allowed himself to be treated and placated and swayed by him. And I say koloshin etter loshin haftzada v'libu that the expression etter is an expression of entreaty and increase. V'chein v'atar anan kakteris is similarly it says in a thick cloud of incense. Marbis alias oshan. The, the immensity of the ascent of smoke. You have multiplied your words against me. Whereas the kisses of an enemy are burdensome. They seem to be many, and they're burdensome. Like in, a, in old French, it's meaning excessive. The Nechef Ishte opposite his wife is a Emir Bezavis Zu, Mispala was a Emir Bezavis Zu, Mispala Liz. What does that mean? Yitzhok was standing in his corner in davening, and Rifka was standing in her corner in davening. But yet, the Loi, accepting his prayer, Rashi says, Loi Veloi Lo. Hers, his, but not hers. Why? You cannot compare the prayer of a righteous man to the, uh, the, the, the son of a righteous man to the son of a wicked man. Therefore, he accepted his prayer and not hers. Pasuk by Yisrael Tzabon and Mikir with the children were struggling within her. Atemrim came and she said, "If it is so, I have such a difficult pregnancy. Why? Why am I like this?" Atelach Lidmi says Hashem, and she went to inquire to Hashem. As she says by Yisrael, so Ad Kana Mikir Azal Inu Darshani. Atemrim recalls for a Medrash interpretation. She saw some ma hiritzitzu because of him kelo mazanechi, for it does not explain what the struggling was. Yet the Torah writes, "If so, why am I like this?" So Omer Rabbi Sira Dershu Lashenitza. So the Torah, the, the Chachamim, interpreted to mean when he writes an expression of ritza, expression of running. What does that mean? Sheheisay veres al piske teda Hashem eiver Yaakov brought some of Farkis Lotzis when she passed by. Yeshivas, Hashem Ve'ever, so Yaakov would run and struggle to come out. Eight, now, Ve'ever, so Pesach HaVedis Elidim, when she passed by the entrance of idolatry, a place of idolatry, Esau Mefarkis Lutzis, Esau would run and struggle to come out, so she didn't understand why this was happening. Dover Acher, another explanation, Ve'eseretzim Zem Zem, Rivim Nachlash Nei Elmes, that they were struggling with each other and fighting about the inheritance of the two worlds. She said, God will tsar her eber. Why do I need to have the pain of pregnancy? Why did I desire to daven to conceive? The academy of shame, leaders of Hashem, Shiyagila, Matihi, Besefa, that he would tell her what would happen at the end. Pasik Chov Gimel, Vayimra Hashem, La. Hashem said to her, Shni Goyim, Bevitnech, two nations are in your womb. And two kingdoms will separate from your innards. And one kingdom will become mightier than the other kingdom. And the elder will serve the younger. And the Lord said to her, I did through a messenger. Shem was told through the divine inspiration, and he told it to her. Rashi says, Geim Ksiv. The word Goyim is written Geim, which is pronounced as Geim, which means exalted people. Who is that? Elu Antanunis Vedebi. This is Antanunis and Rebbe. Who oh, Antanunis came from Esav, and Rebbe came from Yaakov. Shle Pasko Mal Shulchanum Le Tsneim Le Chazeres Le Bimesacham Le Bimesacham. These uh, two great people, Antoninus and Rabbi, from whose tables neither radishes nor lettuce were lacking, either in the summer or the winter, they're very wealthy. Lashnein l'olim, two kingdoms. Ein l'olim elamathos. L'olim always means a kingdom. Bimayach, a will separate from your enemies. 
When Hamayim hein nifradim zel rishe vizel tumei, from the womb they are separated. This one to his wickedness, and this one to his innocence. But Oim Yamites will become mightier than the other kingdom. Lo yish for begdula, they will not be equal in greatness. Eshezekom zen eifu. When one rises, the other will fall. V'chinu Oimer. So it says, Imole acharava. I shall become full from destroyed city. When this malut ser el ruchomanes shalim, they be. Um, Tear become became full gain power only when the, from the destruction of Shalim. Pasif Chavdal, by Yamali Yamela led this, and her days to birth gave birth were completed. Behind a same Vivitna, behold, there were twins in her womb. The Rasha Yamali Yamel, I will the Tamar Siva Ibeis Lidita. But regarding Tamar is written, and it became about the time of Lidita. Shlemali Yamel, because her term, her pregnancy was not filled. For she gave birth to them after seven months. In a same chaser, twins time misspelled chaser. But Tom with Tomer time mali. But concerning Tomer, it's written Taimim with an aleph and a yud. But he should name Zadikim because she had two Zadikim parents and Zera. Well, can Echad Zadik with a Chadrasha? But here there was one righteous, one wicked. Pasach Chavayi said he should add the mini. The first one word red. Kula Kadei Asari was completely like a coat of hair. A Yikarish Shmei Asa, they called them Asa, so Rasha Admini, Simon Lushi, Yashiv, Adumim. Why was he Admini? This is a sign that he is going to shed blood. Kula Kadei Asari was completely like a coat of fear. Here, Malay Seer, Ketal, Shatsem, Ramle Asir, full of hair, like a woolen cloak, which was full of hair. Yikarish Shmei Asa, and they named him Asa, Akol Karl Yechem, they all called him because it was complete. Shaya Nasa, Vidim, Rav Asari, Kivishalam Harbe, and fully developed like here, like one, like a person of many years. But afterwards, his brother murdered. His hands was grasping Esau's heel. And he named him Yaakov. Esau was 60 years old when he gave birth to them. I heard a man of Shagoda that interprets the Pasuk according to a simple meaning. He, Yaakov, held on to him. He had every right. Why? Because Yaakov was from the first trap, and Esau was from the second. Say the man, go learn from a tube that has a narrow opening. Go and put two stones into one, uh, one after the other. So the one that goes in first, will go last. The one that goes last, will go first. So it comes out, Esau, who was formed last, came out first. And Yaakov, who was formed first, came out last. And now Yaakov is coming to hold him back. That he should be the first to be born, as he was formed first. And he would open her womb and take her birth, take the birth right by law. This is a sign that this one Esau will not manage to complete his reign until this one rises up and takes from him. The called him Yaakov because of the holding of his heel. Ten years since he had married her until she became thirteen. Old and be able to conceive. They write, and he looked forward another ten years, and Kavish Yosef of the Sar. He waited another ten years, like Avram to the Sar. Kavish then is Abra. Once they didn't get pregnant, the other she Akara. He knew that she was a barren. He spelled Allah and David for her. Now Yisro did not want to marry Shivcha. Fish the scotch of our Marilis Elat Bimah because he had been hallowed. On Har Maria to be a perfect carbon ayla. Pasig Yechazai Vigla Nardil and the youth grew up. By Esed Ishidir Tzayid Ishsod and Esed was a man who understood hunting. The Angiv Tom Ishtom and 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 Yaakov was a man of the field. Esho Ha'elim Yaakov was an innocent man dwelling in tents. By Yigla Vi Esed calls him Asher Yiktan Lai Nikar Masim. As long as they were small, they were not recognizable for their deeds. I know the Vedakim and Mativ and no one scrutinized them to determine their characters. 
Once they became 13, is that parish of Vladimir Ash? Is that parish of Zara? This one went to go learn, and this one went to Abed Zara. You did, Sayyid. What does it mean? He understood hunting. Lots of Laramai says, Obi Befi Bishad the Abba. He knew how to trap and deceive his father with his mouth and ask, Eich Masin is a middle of the How shall we give Maisir from salt to the straw? So, Rabbi Shah Medak removed the mitzvahs. His father thought that he was extra medactic in the observance of mitzvahs. Ish Sada, a man of the silk, Kim Ashma, as its apparent meaning. Other bottle would say, the Kashti, the highest wave is he's an idler who hunts beasts and birds with his bow. Tom any bakim Khalila Kliba Kane Bifiv. He's not an expert in all the matters, like his heart, so is uh, so is his mouth. Nish any khar of Lamam is karu tom. A person who's not like uh, sharp or astute at deceiving is called a tom. Ishab Ayalim, dwelling in his tents, all they shall shame, all they shall aver. Tent of shame the tent of aver. Puzzle of tennis we have yeah, yeah, we took his we tied bifiv, we akiv loved Asa because his game was in his mouth. Rifka Evas Yakim and Rifka loved Yakim. So actually it removed the Fimshal Yitzhak. The into Yitzchok's mouth. Madrash of Fishal Esav. The Madrash interprets in Esav's mouth. So it's told Esav in Arameo bedvaru. We to trap him and deceive him with words. While Yosef Yaakov knows that Yaakov cooked a pottage. While Yosef Esav asked other people, Oyev Esav was coming from the field and he was very faint. While Yosef Lashin Bishul is an expression of cooking. Oyev he was uh, very tired. We're tzicha from committing murder. But the Tima ki Oyev anafshil orgim as it says for my soul is faint. For the murderers. So Imre Esau Yaakov. Esau said to Yaakov, "Halitani no man adam adam mazeh. Pour into me some of the red red pottage, because I'm very tired. Kill you if anything, because I'm very tired. I'll kain korish from Edom. It was different named Edom. It was actually Halitani. After pee, we shrei chav l'sicha. I open my mouth and you pour very much into it. Kmei shenido in Esin es agnam alav malit leisei. You may not stuff a camel, and you put into his mouth. When I do it, madam, I dash from adumis red lentils." From that day, Avram passed to Yishlo Yir. He said, "Ben Bnei Yir to the Tarbus Rav, in order that he should not see his grandson Esav going to Tarbus Rav the bad ways." And say, "Save it to Yishlo Yir to the Lish For um, for that would not be the good old age that the Yishlo Yir promised him. The Shittir to the Lish Baruchel. Because he's a Lish Baruchel, he cannot be Yishlo Yir. Therefore, Hashem took away five years of Yaakov Avram's life. Why is Yitzchak high? Kofi Shana was a Kofiyan. Hey, now Yitzchak lived to 180, and Yaakov lived to 175. Bishu Yaakov Adosh and the harvest is all. Yaakov was cooking lentils to feed the mourners. Below my Adosh and why lentils? Shadim is the galva because they are round as a wheel. Shavuot is galva achiz b'elam because mourning is like a wheel. It's a, real, a wheel revolving in the world. Why my Adosh and my pad? Just as lentils have no mouth, they have no crack. Kachal and the pestle to Alva's low mouth. Also, the Dabri can't speak. Tinder Hamilla La Harris Alva with Hills Mahali baits him. Therefore, the custom is to feed the mourners eggs in the beginning of the meal. Shogula and the pet, which are round and they do not have a mouth. Kachalva and the pet, drill to Alva's low mouth. Because I've never made cotton, as we discussed the made cotton. Alva called Flesh Yom of the Shim and the Major Shalom called Adam. A mortar for the entire first few days may not respond to anyone's greeting. Closing it in the shell with Hila, I show you may not initiate a greeting. They give a Zion, Meshim in Israel, but from the third to the seventeenth, he respond and not greet. Vayera Yaakov, Michra Chayim, as Mechidos Chali. So Yaakov says, "Sell me on this day your birthright." Zanash Michra Chayim, Ketegomi Kiyim Delehein. Tagma says, "Like this day, Kim Shubar, just as the day is clear." Kach Macharli Mechidah Bura. So sell me with a clear seal. Mechidos Chal, your birthright. The fish I've made the Mechidos since the sacrificial service was performed by the first born. I'm Yaakov. In Rosh Hashanah, Shiakov because the Baruch Hashem said, "The wicked man does not deserve to sacrifice to the Eivishter." So Eishev said, "Behold, I'm going to die. Why do I need to have to be deferred to have this first birthright?" The birthright is something unstable. For the Kurbanis will not always be. The function of the firstborn for the shevet of Levi will take it. But Amar Eisim Mati Bishalve the Zul Eisim said, "What is the nature of the servants?" Amar Lei Kamazaris Van Shen Misus Tlu Bok Eisim Shenino Eilah Eishu Ben Misus Shu Yain Efru Yerish Amar Ani Eilah Flamos Al Yada Im Ken Machafes Liba. So Eisim said, "Ziyaka told him there are many sort of and punishments and deaths penalty involved in this." We learned rather these are the ones are liable to death. Those performing the uh, service. 
who uh, drank wine, those who would not cut their hair, Asa said, no, I'm going to die because of the birthright. If so, why should I want it? Yaakov said, swear to me on this day. So he swore to him and he sold his birthright to Yaakov. Yaakov nestled Asa lechem and Asa dadashem. Yaakov gave Asa bread and a pottage of lentils. And he ate and he drank. And he arose and he left. And he was in of his prayer. And Asa despised the birthright of Rashi. He had a terror attest his wickedness that he despised the service of Hashem. There was a famine in the land inside for the first famine. Asher Yibim Avram, which was in the days of Avram. Melech Yitzchak Al Avimel, Melech Plishtim Gradach. Yitzchak went to Avimel, the king of Plishtim to Gradach. Vayedo, Elav Hashem, and Hashem appeared to him. Vayim Ralph Yedim Mitzrayim, did not go down to Mitzrayim. Shechein Baris will dwell in Eretz Yisrael. Asherim Re'lechav. I try to tell you, Zagrashi, I'll tell you, Mitzrayim, why should die to so he died to let us with Sarai Malcolm and Shir of Mianov. He thought, I'll go down to Mitzrayim just like my father did. I'm going to tell you, Mitzrayim, I'll tell you, Mitzrayim, said, Do not go down to Mitzrayim because you are a perfect offering. And being outside of the rest of the soul is not fitting for you. Gorbar is Aziz, live in this land. I will be with you and I will bless you. For you and your seed, I will give you these lands. And I will establish the oath that I swore to Avram your father. multiply seed the stars of the heaven. And I will give your seed all the lands. And all the nations of the earth will bless themselves by your seed. A man uh, tells his son, May Hashem be like the tr- may your children be like the children of Yisach. And the following says through you shall Israel bless, saying, May Hashem see you, Ephraim and Manasha. And, and we find this in regards to a curse, and the woman shall be a curse, or by um, a person who curses his enemy says, May you be like the, that particular woman. May you, may you leave your name as an oath to be chosen. Whereby one who takes an oath says, May I be like that particular person if I did such and such. Because Avram hearkened to my voice, and kept my commandments, my commandments, my statutes, and my instructions. This is referring to the crease that distances itself from secondary Yisurim of the Rabbanon. If it had not been written, it would have been fit to be commanded in Gezel like robbery and bloodshed. These are things that the Yitzhara and the nations of the world argue with. Like pork and shanash in Tambadar, there's no reason for it. It's just a statue of the king. So this is to include Tadish Shabal Pe and Allah Hamish from Messina.